My name is Lydia Jotam Adams and I want to testify of God's faithfulness over my life. And specifically last year, January, January 30th, 31st, I, I got to know I was pregnant towards the end of January. So I had to go to one of the scan centers here to run a scan as prescribed by my sister-in-law. And when I got there, when it was my turn for the scan, he looked at me and the first thing he said was, do you know you have fibroid? And I told him, I don't have fibroid. He paused and looked at me and said, you don't have fibroid or they've never told you you have fibroid. And I told him, I said, I don't have fibroid. Whatever the system is showing you, just tell me. He said, okay. He's seen a fibroid and he's seen an ovarian cyst, even though I was pregnant. Those reports alone were yeah, meant to put fear in me, but supernaturally, like, they were coming to my heart to put fear in me, but I tried to consciously tell myself I don't have fibroid, I don't have ovarian cyst. When I left there, I called my sister-in-law who happened to be a nurse. She was scared, like, fibroid, ovarian cyst, how come? And then I got back home, I met the apostle over this commission, Apostle Joe Tambo by Adams. I showed him the report I got from the scan that they said they have. That was the word I used. I said they said they have fibroid and ovarian cysts. And he told me, he said, you don't have fibroid and ovarian cysts. He said, the only thing growing in your womb is my baby. And then he prayed with me and told me that every day of the pregnancy, I should take the communion. And then, lo and behold, by March, I went for a second scan, fibroid gone, ovarian cyst gone. All this scan I did all through pregnancy, there was no longer fibroid and there was no longer ovarian cyst. And to the glory of God, the baby in the womb came out successfully in September. I have come to give thanks to God for his faithfulness and for walking wonders through the communion table. May his name alone be praised forever.